Hey guys, um, <clears throat> this is gonna be a little review here about the Oakley uh, crowbar goggles. Um, this channel, I know it's scooter kid videos, but uh, it's not all for scootering. I do race BMX, so you will see some BMX stuff on here. Um, so my first BMX review for racing will be the Oakley Crowbars MX, not the sand version, just the MX. Um, mine are the Troy Lee Signatures. And then the back of them have this little Velcro thing. Uh, you can actually buy custom ones customize your own uh, and then on this side here you have the little Troy Lee thing stitched into it and then on the back it's just green um, your rubbery surface so it sticks onto your goggle or your helmet um, uh, these are the Troy Lee signatures like I said they come in like a purple and then this Purple ones are $80, and they just had the dark gray lens. Um, these had the fire iridium lens, which are an extra 25 If you're uh, going to buy just, if you bought regular crowbars and you want to replace the lens. So these were $100, um, which if you're just going to buy regular crowbars, uh and buy this lens, it'd be 95 so really it's $5 more, you can get Troy Lee signatures. Um, has the nose piece, that can be taken off uh, here in the bottom. Crowbars are red, which are really nice, because most of them aren't colored, they're just black. Uh, really good um, padding in there, it's like double layered for sweat and stuff. And I use these for BMX racing, so when it's out, when it's winter time like it is now, it's really cold at the track, and it's, my eyes water up, but with these, like, I stay really warm. Like, this part of, the part of my face that this covers, they stay really warm. Um, nose piece keeps my nose warm, actually. It really helps. Uh, and with the crowbars, most goggles, you'll see, they don't, the crowbars aren't actually attached to the goggle itself where the strap meets. Um, so what that does is that allows for a more even fit pull around your face. So it's like my other Oakleys are the proven OTG Oakleys. Um, those I felt really tight like where the straps met the goggle itself, the frame. Um, so these fit really evenly around your face. It's not too tight, but it keeps it the padding all like up against your face. So you stay warm, you stay clean, um, you stay dry. Now, if you're into dirt biking and you're you ride where there's a lot of sand, you can get the sand goggle, the crowbars. Um, they're only in two different colors. There no there's no signature models of that model um and then these are just the mx i think they make crowbar snow goggles too um by far these are the best oakley's for bmxing just even dirt biking because they come with seven tear offs in the bag uh it's just a clear if you don't know what it is it's a clear piece of lexon that uh go, snaps on these little black knobs um just to protect the uh, lens itself and one quick thing with this lens do not touch the inside of it it has like this film on it that will is really hard to clean mine are uh, fairly clean if you get fingerprints in there it's guaranteed you're not going to get them out um, so that's just something to look out for and I'll set these aside um, and of course adjustable these aren't made for kids, young, littler kids that have smaller heads because uh, Oakley, well, I don't know if they do anymore, 
but when I bought my first pair of Oakleys, they came in different sizes. These are just one size. Um, when they come with the, the bag, which do not lose this no matter what Oakleys you get. It's $40 for a new one. So uh, this is the Troy Lee Signature Bag, because the goggles are. Um, you can use it for clean, cleaning the goggles and you should always put your goggles back in here. And it comes with a little uh, pull string so it keeps them in there, keeps them safe, keeps them dry, keeps them clean. Uh, so if your lens are dirty, just wipe them off and you're good to go. So yeah, that was the uh, Oakley Crowbar MX. Troy Lee Signature Goggle Review. Um, just subscribe, subscribe to me for more videos like this. Um, if you'd like to see more reviews. And uh, comment if you have any questions. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Um, and be sure to like this video. Later.